We are concerned here with, a, with an act of humanity. It followed from the special theory of relativity. Friends, on 14th March 1819, a person was born in this world who changed the direction of body human development and human history and gave us a new way of looking at the world. Yes, I'm talking about Albert Einstein, the most revolutionary scientist of the 21st century, due to which we not only understand the depth of the universe and its secrets, but also what is the meaning of time and reality. We knew this only because of the scientist, but do you know that once a country influenced Albert Einstein and offered him to become the president? Or do you know about the solar eclipse, which if it did not happen during that time, Albert Einstein, despite being intelligent, would have remained anonymous forever. For what reasons was Albert Einstein awarded the Nobel Prize? Option A, Magnetism Theory. Option B, Gravitational Theory. Option C, Law of Relativity. Or Option D, Law of Photoelectric Effect. Why? Doesn't it look interesting? You can select any of these answers and tell us in the comments whether it is A, B, C or D, which we will understand that you have understood our question. And like every time, this time also, we are going to give you the answer of this question through this video. If you want to get such information from time to time, then subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. Let's go ahead and tell you complete information about it. Friends, almost every child is aware of the name of Albert Einstein and why not? Albert Einstein, scientist may have been great, but in school, he was not a T-smart car, but an average child. But his mind was no ordinary mind. Albert's mind was a little different from childhood and he was a bit too sharp and special for the time. After the death, so special his brain was also stolen. Well, was it really stolen? Because you yourself think when the great scientist of the world must have died, was it so normal that a man comes and takes out Einstein's brain? This sounds very strange to hear, doesn't it? So let's know the truth. What was special in Einstein's mind? You will know this, but before that, let me know a little about Einstein. Albert Einstein was born in Jewish family in Germany. His father was an engineer and salesman by profession and his mother was a housekeeper. Einstein initially had difficulty speaking and was not very good at studies. Although his mother tongue was German, he later learned Talvi and English as well. Perhaps they too must have realized that as today, in our country more values is given to English than our mother language Hindi. The same situation should happen in Germany as well. In fact, after he was born, doctor noticed that his head was too large for any normal child and he was born as a normal child. At the time, medical science was not so developed, that was the reason for his big head could be known. While growing up, the circumstances with Einstein were such that he came to be considered an unusual and perhaps even abnormal child. Despite being unusual, his mind was so sharp that even today, no one could compete with him. Even though his mind was sharp and there was a problem that too to speak. Any common child learns to speak in a year or two. And as we told you that Albert Einstein had difficulty in speaking from the beginning. In such a situation, till a very old age, he did not even speak. His parents were very upset because of his non-speaking. At the age of four, he learned to speak for the first time, but even then he could not speak clearly. He used to speak half incomplete and often remained silent. He started speaking at the age of nine. The story of which is very interesting. It's about dinner time. He was also sitting at the dining table for dinner with his mother and father. Suddenly he said the soup was very hot. His parents were happy to hear this later, but at the first they were shocked at his clear voice and they asked him why he was not speaking until now. So Einstein's answer was that till now everything was correct. Now tell me, in such a situation, what do you think that his parents would have been more happy or shocked? By the way, Einstein himself was also funny and many of his habits were also laughable. He did not wear socks because his socks used to get holes. Another reason for this was also that he believed that if one is working, then what is the need for wearing two? At many farmhouse dinners, parties, he used to go without socks like this. 
once went to oxford lectures the same way but the attention of the students was more on their big hairs than his socks actually einstein did not like getting a haircut at all one can guess this by looking at his long hair let us tell you that in spite of having such a great mathematics albert was considered to be a person of very poor memory he could not remember names dates phone numbers surprised what happened today perhaps you must be smiling a little after hearing this and whoever heard this from his time till today was surprised well you will also be surprised to know but einstein was not so intelligent albert einstein was also called retarded due to being weak in studies since childhood in childhood he was counted among the stupid children due to some of his antics some people even started calling him physically handicapped now it may be that one of you must have heard this story too but friends this is a reality but now do you not think that every weak child of childhood will turn out to be einstein maybe someone should be also become rohit of koi mil gaya movie well his teacher did not like einstein because he used to pass only in the subject of maths and science and failed in every other subject from childhood he was not interested in book knowledge nevertheless he presented many such theses of science without which the scientists are still weak be it e is equal to mc square or theory of relativity and this is the reason why his mind remains a topic of discussion even today yes let's discuss his mind on 18th april 1955 the famous scientist albert einstein died in china then a pathologist named dr thomas tartus harvey stole einstein's brain during the autopsy and no one even came to know about it actually this doctor wanted to test einstein's brain what was it in albert einstein's mind due to which einstein made so many physics discoveries at the same time he published more than 300 scientific research papers in his life like you and dr thomas was also surprised and wanted to know the secret of einstein's intelligence for this reason thomas stole his brain from the dead body the work for which he was fired and he promised that he would definitely find out about albert's brain so that in the coming time it could be of same benefit to science and the scientist but due to lack of permission dr thomas harvey imprisoned einstein's brain inside a four wall later in 1975 when his son got its permission and he started research on einstein's brain first he measured the weight of his brain which weighed 1230 grams which was very small according to the normal human let us tell you that the weight of human brain is about 1400 grams after that dr harvey sent 240 sample of his brains to many scientists after having a look he found that his brain had more cells than a normal human being some time ago in research it was found that the part of einstein's brain named cerebellum was different from that of a normal human being friends let us tell you that the cerebellum is an important part of human brain which is considered to be most complex if that was the reason for an ordinary thinking of his mind einstein always used to say that there is no such special thing in me but i am such a person who has a lot of desire to know by the way how will his brain work for a research scientist so you will tell us by commenting that how right was the idea of stealing einstein's brain for research also one more interesting thing is that albert einstein has been given the nobel prize for the law of photoelectric effect friends we hope that you like the video if you like the video then like and share it with your friends and relatives and to keep getting more information like this subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon see you in the next video till then take care of yourself